Welcome to The Published Plot. I'm Nate. I'm Jessica. And I'm Mike. A few weeks ago, we announced that we were going to be doing a giveaway for one of Mr. Jimmy Aiken's books, The Bible is a Catholic Book. Which, amazingly, I've kept not sticky in the meantime. We have also managed <laughs> to not get it more glittery than it was before. I'm disappointed about that. I'm going to be it, honest It's with almost you. Advent. Something's going to pop up sometime. <laughs> you know, it's probably that when we were announcing the giveaway, I oversold the glitter, and that's why it hasn't gotten all glittery. And Possibly. I blame myself. So, when we announced the giveaway, we said that in order to qualify, mm -hmm. uh, one of our viewers must go and comment in the video mm -hmm. their favorite book of the Bible, mm -hmm. and then send us an email with same. And they had to be a resident or at least have a mailing address of the USA. We had one person who commented from Canada, and I looked up just to see... And it was going to be forty-five dollars. So sorry, you're not in the running. <laughs> unfortunately, for unfortunately, our, our little show currently has a budget of well, nothing. So <laughs> although I would say that what we should do is put all of our Canadian mailing money into a trebuchet fund, so that eventually we can get them the book without giving money to the Royal Mail or whatever they have in the Canadas. That's yes, fair. Please go on the very trebuchet. edge of Canada. We'll go on the very edge of Detroit and just. Chuck it across. We could totally work this out. Yeah, you could signal us from Windsor. Yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. Or, you know, if you don't and want to go that far go south, to our, our, Sarnia. Our own casinos and be disappointed at them. <laughs> oh, I hate casinos. <laughs> Anyways, we had a number, we had a number of, uh, of responses. Uh,. A few people who, who were who were interesting in this book. We are, of course, going to go and completely devalue the book by signing a book that we did not write ourselves. And then so, put a sticker in it that was blessed because apparently a priest will bless anything if you just, you know, mention it and have it in front of him. Yeah. We didn't even ask. Well, I presume... <laughs> he I presume... I presume, they I, presume blessed. I presume a simple caveat of... Anything that would be worth blessing kind of a thing. Yeah, I mean, I'm fairly certain if we put something uh, sacrilegious or, or, or something like that in front of him, sure, he might sure. be like, I'm not going to bless that. Well, unless he was going to bless it to redeem it. That's fair. But this is the published plot. It's a blessing to all who see it. Exactly. <laughs> so, Mike has one of Nate's dies, and he's going to roll it. Here we go. So maybe he has more, you know, good rolls in it than us, who have wasted them all on, you know, checking to see if... Something is there on a game when no one was there anyway. Well, my long history of playing Risk would indicate that no, no, I'm not good at rolling. I've had many a quality offensive undone by bad rolling. Mm. Many it, an impregnable defense breached due to bad rolling. He's of course a referring land war to Risk. In Asia? Well, of course. Of oh. course it was a land war it's in risk. Asia. The whole yeah. point is to fight land wars in Asia. So here we go. All right. So our winner is Apple Pecan Sows. Congratulations. Congratulations, we will be sending you an email so that we can go and get uh, contact information in order for us to try and get this book to you. Yes. Also known as your mailing address. Yes. Mm -hmm. But, of course, we now have to devalue the book by signing Please. it. First sticker. Boom. Blessed sticker. This is the only... Oh, there it is. <laughs> yes, the only one that doesn't have a breakaway. <laughs> <laughs> there has to be one. I mean, just the odds. So, now we've increased the value of the book by putting an extremely rare, blessed sticker on it. No, we, we completely devaluated it at this point because now you can't sell it. It's a sin. No, no. We've, we've increased its real worth. Okay. You can't monetize it, but it's worth yes. more. Yes. As these stickers have been blessed, you can no longer sell this book. That I would, mean... That you, would be Simon. You, you can remove the sticker and either bury or burn it as we taught the music guy like two weeks ago at church what to do with blessed objects because someone blessed a guitar apparently. So, inside of the cover... So, first or, you or, smash or, or, or title it, page. Townsend style. Yeah. Inside oh, the, it, it, title wherever. page. Title. We, we discussed the fact that, you know, nowhere in that does it say you cannot go and smash the guitar before you burn and bury it. In fact, you probably should, because that'll make it burn better. <laughs> make it more kindling-like. <laughs> it's very serious business. It's like we're signing a treaty, so everything suddenly went quiet. It's hard to sign and remember what your name is in talk. <laughs> I've only had it for so many years. <laughs> is that with a C or a K? It depends on if my great uncle was in charge of naming me. <laughs> he was not. <laughs> so there you have it. We have 
We have we have devalued a book by putting a sticker on the inside of the cover and by writing in it. And then we'll ruin the spline by just like chucking some, you know, extra stickers in there. Yep. <laughs> so that's hey. all good and ready for, for Apple Pecan Sews. Mm-hmm. As soon as we go and get a mailing address for you, we'll be sending it out. So be sure to check your email for, for, for a letter from the Popish Plot. <laughs> and until next time. And until next time, remember to live your faith. Love your faith. And share, share that, that love. love. And continue to read your danged Bible. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>